definitely the best part of the night for, for myself. Just um, like I said after the game, that you know that's what I think I'll miss when I uh, retire is that feeling of um, you know walking off the pitch knowing that you're giving your all, but knowing that the players respect you, you know, you know that you've got your brothers respect, and that was definitely by far the best part of the night tonight for me. Uh, you know, I can't remember the last time I cried, but it you know definitely brought you know. Uh, I was a little bit teary up there just seeing the brothers get up and, and show that respect. So hopefully, um, like I said to them straight away, I said, you know, one more week, hopefully I can put in another strong performance for the brothers and um, hopefully we can do it for, for the Kiwis. Definitely it's always nice to be recognised and uh, such a massive award like this is very, uh, I, was, I was quite shocked um, to be honest, but it was just, it was just a nice feeling to be recognised. But like I said on stage, um, I take I take that award on behalf of um, the great teams that I've been involved with this year and the great coaches that I've been involved with. So um, and also my family, but uh, very very thankful. The biggest thing is for me is that I've 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 found um, I've found peace of mind in myself as a man, and um, I think that comes down to a lot of uh, uh, comes comes down to uh, a lot. Obviously, with my religion um, has played a big, massive part in that. But um, also, just uh, you know, um, just just keeping things simple and and not getting too far ahead of myself and thinking thinking about what I got to do today, then rather than what what's going to happen tomorrow or the next day. Because um, you know, I think you know, simplicity is the key. And um, obviously, it's it's worked this year for myself. I wasn't really teary until I seen the boys do the haka. You know. Um, that means the world to me. All, all I want is respect, you know. And I felt like, you know, um, after the way I left the game, you know, I lost a lot of respect. But this year, just the way I try to carry myself and um, just try to, you know, get across the, the real me, um, I felt like, you know, I earned a, a lot of respect. But the biggest thing for me is um, earning the respect of my fellow players and coaches. Um, and, you know, I think that's why I was a little bit emotional at the end there, just knowing that, you know, you don't get a haka done to you from the from the brothers for no reason if they don't respect you. So, um, but you know, like I said before, straight afterwards, I said, you know, let's go, boys, one more week. It's um, you know, it's it's game on this weekend. You know, we got uh, something special that we can, you know, we can create something special. Um, but we got to show up, and I'm pretty sure, you know, why I know that Australia will too. Uh, I said after the the game on the bus yesterday, actually, I got players player. And I said to the boys, um, they gave me a bit of stick for using the word accolade. But I said, you know, no accolades can beat getting um, the respect of you boys. And that's all I ever want to do. And, um, you know, I'd give that award, every award back in a heartbeat just to get the, get, get, 